morning everybody. We're starting our day out today at the Sycamore Springs uh, Mineral Spas where it's basically like these jacuzzis you get that are tucked away in the mountain. So if you can see, I don't know if it's the mountain, maybe just the hillside, but like there's different little uh, hot tubs all throughout here and all the way back in there. And so we have our own little secluded one called Twilight. It's, you know, you get like this boards covering yourself and then the cool little hot tub. And then we also picked up some breakfast. We grabbed a coffee and bagels from this place called... I don't know what it's called. It doesn't say it on the bag. So we got some bagels for breakfast and coffee. And we're just going to sit here and have a good soak. our wine tour and it was really awesome we had a really cool uh, tour guide she was very helpful and helped us better understand because we don't know a lot about wine and we're still learning and so she gave us a lot of useful information that helps us better understand the process and it, it really is a long process to get to the bottle of wine which is really interesting the bottle of wine that we did end up purchasing it is actually really cool because the grapes were in Paso Robles and Big Sur had a big fire in 2015 or 16? One of those years. And so the fire actually made a smoky flavor inside the grapes, which is really cool. And you can actually taste it in the wine. So we got a bottle of that, and now we are heading back. We are getting, uh, we sat and we had a little lunch there first. We brought our own little cheese and salami and crackers and stuff, so that was fun. Um, it was really cool too because um, since it is a weekday, there aren't a lot of people there, so we, it was just us and the tour guide, which the last winery we went to, we were with like a group of like 10 to 12 people, so it was very personal. Um, we are heading back down to our Airbnb right now. I think we're going to change because it actually turned out to be a beautiful day. It's like, it says it's 66 right now, but it feels like a good 75, right? The sun's out. It's breezy. It's beautiful. So we're going to spend the rest of the day at the beach. We might get dinner down there and this is our last full day and I'm really sad. Usually by the end of vacation, so I'm like, okay, I think I'm ready to go home now, but I don't feel ready. Do you? Not at all. So we're sad. Back to reality. We're back out on the beach by the pier to our favorite Bismo Beach swings. And it's just going to be a relaxing rest of the day of just hanging out here and probably going back and watching TV or something like that. Yeah, we're tired. It's been a I am exhausted. Day. Tomorrow we're waking up a little bit earlier to come down and look for some more sand dollars on the beach. Too much food, too much sweets. I've definitely gained another 10 pounds. <laughs> like, I'm, He's not a disaster. Yeah. <laughs> too many shark gummies, too many cookies, too much cake. Oh, we didn't vlog that we ate cake. <laughs> Whoops. But. We came on these swings like a couple years ago and they are so much taller. I can't even get on. <laughs> She's struggling. Okay, okay, so the swing is at her like lower back. <laughs> Go! Nice! Look at that strength! But then I can't. <laughs> no momentums. No momentums. Alright, I got you, honey. Uh. Uh. Kick! <laughs> it was really gloomy when we got here like an hour and a half ago and now the sun's coming out and it's beautiful. Yeah. What a nice last day. So after we saw the uh, walruses or sea, whatever you call those animals in San Francisco at Pier 39 at the, and at the pier over at Avila Beach, I wanted to see an otter like out in the ocean like not in a zoo because we've seen him there before and we found one and he's really close to shore he's like right here oh of course now he goes underwater oh he's right there right here he's in the waves let's see there he is where is he there he is he's eating something on his like belly 
He's just floating all the way down. <laughs> oh, he got rolled over in that way. <laughs> that is so crazy. He's like right there. Like literally, that's, you could stand. Oh, the water, I got my shoes on still. Like literally, you could stand right where he's swimming. So cute, he's so close. <laughs> he's like right there. Back on our uh, ecosystem hunt. We, we found a freaking hermit crab. We found a crab trying to get out of his shell or maybe back to the water. See? He's stuck. <laughs> We're gonna help him. That is so freaking cool. Wait, Look hold at on. that, guys. I can't get it. There he is. Oh, water. Here comes. Give him in the water. 